In this video, we will show you how you can change logo in our Storyline templates. Here you can see the placeholder logo. In this view, you can't select and edit the logo because it's placed in the Slide Master. So let's go to View and here you will find Slide Master View. Now we are in the Master Slide View, but somehow the logo is still unavailable for us. That's because the logo is placed in the main Master Slide that is always the first one. Move on to the first one and here you can see that new objects and layers appear on the screen. Now we are able to select the logo and with the right mouse click we can select the option Replace Picture. Choose your logo image from your files and double click on it. Now we have changed the logo image but it looks a bit tiny. Let's go to the Format tab and in the right corner we can change the size of the image. Great, the logo looks fine. We just need to adjust this green hotspot. Even though the action is set to image, we still need this green hotspot above the logo so that the hand cursor would appear when the learner hovers over the logo. It is placed inside the states. Select the logo and click Edit States. Now we are able to select the hotspot and we can drag it a little bit bigger to cover full image. Great, now we can close Master View and see how the new logo will appear in the preview. Select Preview this slide and here we can see our new logo that will appear in all slides and if we hover over we will notice the hand cursor. That's it. We have successfully changed the logo in our Storyline template.